is that annoying air network change error in Chrome stopping you from browsing? Don't worry, I've got four easy fixes to get you back online in no time. Hey there, I'm Jade from Rapid Cloud, where we keep your website fast, secure, and always online. Today, I'm going to help you fix the Air Network Change error in Chrome, a common issue that can really mess up your browsing experience. First, what exactly is this error? This error pops up when Chrome detects that your network configuration has changed. It could mean that your internet connection was interrupted, your router settings were altered, or there's an issue with your DNS settings. In short, Chrome can't connect to the internet properly because something in your network setup has changed. Let's start with the simplest fix, restarting your router. Many times, a quick reboot can resolve connectivity issues by resetting your network connection. Just unplug your router, wait for about 10 seconds, and plug it back in. Once your internet connection is re-established, try refreshing the Chrome page that gave you the error. If it works, great! If not, we've got more steps to try. Reset network configurations. If restarting your router didn't do the trick, the next step is to reset your network configurations. To reset network configurations on Windows, you need to open Command Prompt as administrator by pressing Windows plus S and typing CMD. Right-click on Command Prompt and select Run as Administrator. In the Command Prompt window, type the following command and press Enter. This will release your current IP address, disconnecting your computer from the network. Next, type the following command and press Enter. This clears out the DNS cache, which can help resolve network connection issues. Now type this next command and press Enter. This command will request a new IP address from your router, reconnecting your computer to the network. Once all the commands have been executed, close the command prompt and restart your computer to apply all the changes. To reset network configurations on Mac, click on the Apple menu and select System Settings. Go to Network to view your network settings. Select the network service you're having issues with from the list on the left. Click on Details and then Forget this network. Now reconnect to that same network and see if your problem has been resolved. Next, check if you have any VPN or proxy settings enabled. VPNs create a secure and private tunnel between you and the internet, encrypting all your data. This setup is ideal for protecting your online privacy and securing your connection on public Wi-Fi networks. Proxies, on the other hand, don't encrypt your connection but can redirect your internet traffic. This can be useful for accessing region-restricted content or managing internet usage in a corporate environment. Sometimes VPNs and proxies can interfere with your network connection and cause the air network change error. If you're running a VPN, disable it through the application interface. Most VPNs have a simple toggle switch to turn the connection on or off. To readjust your proxy settings on Windows, press Windows key, type Internet Options and select the corresponding result. Navigate to the Connections tab and click on LAN Settings. If Use a Proxy Server for your LAN is checked, uncheck it to disable your proxy. Also ensure Automatically Detect setting is checked for good measure. Click OK to apply the changes. To adjust proxy settings on a Mac, open System Settings and go to Network. Under your current Wi-Fi, click on Details. Switch to the Proxies tab. Here you can uncheck any proxies that are currently enabled, whether manual or automatic configurations. Click OK to save your changes. Finally, let's check your DNS settings. DNS, or Domain Name System, acts like the Internet's phone book, translating human-friendly domain names into IP addresses that computers use to communicate with each other. If there's a malfunction in this process, you might encounter connectivity issues. Let's take a look at how you can adjust your DNS settings to troubleshoot this error. To do this in Windows, go to the Network Status screen and head to Advanced Network Settings, then Change Adapter Options. The next screen will include a list of your available network connections. Look for the option that includes your Wi-Fi network's name. Right-click on that option and choose Properties, then go to Internet Protocol version 4. 
By default, this screen will have the Obtain an IP address automatically and Obtain DNS server address automatically options enabled. If you're using a custom IP address or DNS servers, we recommend reverting to the default settings temporarily. If you want to continue using a custom DNS, you'll need to temporarily switch to a different option. This should keep you from continuing to run into this error. To adjust your DNS settings on macOS, click on the Apple menu at the top left corner of your screen and select System Settings. Click on the Network icon on the left sidebar and find the current network you're using. Click on Details and on the left sidebar, go to the DNS tab to view your DNS settings. To add a new DNS server, click the plus button under the DNS servers list. Enter the IP address of your preferred DNS server. Common public DNS servers include Google DNS and Cloudflare DNS. To remove an existing DNS server, select it from the list and click the minus button. After adding or removing DNS servers, click OK to save your changes. Just like a stable internet connection is key to smooth browsing, a reliable hosting service is crucial for your website's performance. With Rapid Cloud's high performance hosting, your site stays fast and secure, giving your visitors the best experience no matter what network issues they might face. After all, a great website deserves a great host. Click the link in the description and get started with Rapid today. And there you have it. 4 easy steps to fix the Air Network Change error in Chrome. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell so you never miss out on more tech tips. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.